Good evening and welcome to our first con concert of 7th grade. My name is Astor and I play the trumpet. My name is Sydney and I play the flute. This piece, Above and Beyond by James Marijan, is a heroic and upbeat song. As you listen, you can really hear all the instruments playing the triumphantly together. This song really speaks to us because it brings us together as one. Thank you for listening and hope you enjoy this uplifting song by James Swearingen.
Um, we had a bunch of students in May last year go to solo festival. These students learned a solo, they were able to perform in front of a judge, and they get lots of comments back. It's a really, really, really cool thing. I try to encourage students to do solo festival at least one time, at least one time during middle school, just to get that experience. Um, with that, we had one student selected for the Junior High Area All-State Band this year, and he's in our trombone section, and that was Ryan Nee. So Ryan's gonna stand up. in January, and then students are also able to um, participate in the Solo Festival in May as well. So we're looking forward to that this year. Neil looks like she's ready to go, so I'm going to hand the microphone off to her. Good evening. My name is Nia, and I'm a percussionist. This next piece is called Hercules vs. the Hydra. In this piece, we'll hear every section of replicating the battle between Hercules and the nine-headed water spoon. Who is victorious at the end? You'll have to listen and to the very end to find out. Thank you for coming and we hope you enjoy Hercules vs. the Hydra.
they did an awesome, awesome job. So before Gus and Bruno, you're just going to hang out with me for a second. I have lots of thank yous that I want to make sure that I give shout outs to the people that deserve them. Um, First of all, our, the support that we have, our superintendent, from, uh, Dr. McGowan, our entire Board of Education, the TCMS administration right here, Ms. Danielle Edmonds, Dr. Mike Malloy, and Ms. Betsy Paddock, the support that they give these musicians and us, I just feel so lucky to be working in a district that supports music the way that Brighton does. Um, especially also Dr. Tracy Glazer, our Director of Visual Performing Arts, and her secretary, Charlotte kimberly Hank. Um, there's a lot of things that go behind the scenes before this happens, so huge, huge shout out to them. Um, here tonight, uh, Mr. Jack Whitmer and his Sound and Lights crew, along with our live stream, Eric Gruner and his whole team. So those people on the live stream, welcome, and I love that you're here, that's awesome. So thank you to all of them. Uh, my whole music colleagues, at T or not only at TCMS, but from Council Rock all the way up to the high school. A big shout out to my TCMS colleagues here, though. Um, uh, Ms. Claire DeGlees, Ms. Kendra Lamb, Ms. Jenny Mall is here, Ms. Picciarelli. Um, they're back there. They are just, they help me with everything every single day, and I don't know what I would do without them. And then lastly, of course, all of you here in the audience, I have to say a huge thank you to all of you for encouraging students to practice, getting them here at the concert tonight, you know, putting up with all of my Sunday emails. Yes, I will put go bills in all of my Sunday emails until they win the Super Bowl. So just got to just got to put up with that for me as well. So seriously, thank you so so much to everybody that has allowed this to happen on stage tonight. We have one more piece for you that I think you'll recognize, and I'm going to let my friend Gus and Varun uh, announce that. Hi, my name is Varun, and I play tenor saxophone. I'm going to introduce Gus, and I play flute. Havana is a song by Cuban American artist Camila Cabello, taken from her first solo album, Camila. It is her best charting lead single since leaving the music group Fifth Harmony. In this song, Cabello sings of her love for the city of Havana, Cuba, and her Cuban heritage. The pop star moved back and forth between Havana and Mexico City as a child before settling in Miami. The track was co-written by Pharrell Williams, while Frank Duke supplies a Latin-inspired beat. Now, fun fact, based on streaming alone, this song was calculated to have made $370,000. So, enjoy. <laughs> thing before we play as well. Um, after this concert, the 8th graders actually have their concert as well. So if you want to meet us all in the atrium, that's where you can pick up these lovely musicians at the end. Um, but thank you so much for coming out tonight. I hope everyone has a wonderful holiday, and we're looking forward to our March 9th concert.